Hi everybody, good morning. Uh, this room now, <coughs> this compiler, we have a binary file. And then we're looking for a password. Okay, the, the binary, I have it here. So if I run the binary, uh, it asks for the password. If I say test, it said password wrong. So if I go to all days string and say compile, is interesting thing correct and he say do you even ctf something will come and say oh maybe that's the password let's try that and then said no it's a uh, no there's a function in linux called uh, this s trace to trace um, the, the, the the when you run um, binaries like that the s trace what it give us Okay, it said, um, you see, password, I think we should use the L trace, not the S trace. Okay, let's use the L trace. If you L trace, the, it will say, ask password, if I say test, notice very thin because there's an empty file here and an empty here and they say try again so if we do this and they let's say we use that funny password that we uh, assume there so what you see something very interesting happen here it comparing this guy the, the, uh, the only this part you see let me come back to this now we can understand what is going on if you go to Hydra, I, I, I open the compiled file in, in my, uh, my, uh, my Ghidra. As always, you, it's better to go to Function. Look for the main function to see what's going on. Okay, we have the main function here. The main function, of course, you can see that uh, do you even uh, CTF story. So we have uh, two functions, this scanf, which is picked up there, the, these, uh, no, these, uh, the scanf is the one that takes the data, then there is a compare file. Now this very, very interesting part in uh, here, Wh what exactly these do? From, from, from the, from the L trace, the L trace, we can see it, it take the last character. So basically this input, this variable local 28, is in fact this one whatever we type after this, uh, the, the 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 s and and you notice when when we we type something like strange like I, if i type a test you know it's empty because when you do this when you put this here it mean whatever you type must start with this keyword this um uh, there's a little script here I did, uh, did with the help of my friend ChatGPT. If I run this, same things. If I put test, you know the the variable here, uh, the re, uh, no no no, the print, the first print, the print, whatever I enter, it, it it's empty, because now I didn't put this in the front. So if I run again, and I said this and put just one two three. Now it tell me you print one two three, and that's why this room you can solve it here, either from looking to this the this, or solve it here from the L trace, because remember the L trace what it do. It tell us that it it take the last characters, compare it to this, and then compare it to this. Now, if we go to Ghidra, this is the first comparison that happened and then there is the second one so the first one compared to this dso handle and then the other one to unit now if you look what 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 compare function in c do uh, this is the compare function uh, the, the st string compare function which would which we have here Basically, what it say: if the two strings are equal, the result is zero. If not, uh, if uh, if the first no matching character in the string is greater than, it will be positive. Then put negative. An example is this: uh, string one and string three because they are equal, it gives zero. So basically, if we look to this code, 
the only way this to 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 equal to zero if this variable must be unit so if we go back to l trace so this one need to be this that's why you can solve it from here that's why you can guess the password so you can f from as i said so if you uh, if you put um, any strange variable let's say one two three four four it's empty so we, you know here that you need to have uh, the password need to start with um, with this with do you even and the only one the only way for this to equal zero so this one will be underscore unit which is basically here you can see here underscore unit so for this to be underscore unit so we need to have this variable all of it and the unit because it take the last variable if you come back to the compiler and so run it again so if I said do you even and then we need to have unit there then what I enter so this variable now local 28 will be unit underscore unit come here it's equal zero and of course this is a I think this is more like a, a little uh, rabbit hole was added because this it, uh, it was made this variable was chosen specifically so the the compare to this it will be always uh, uh, it it always was correct so this is not part of the you can say just was added to some kind of little rabbit hole here the whole the whole thing is here there is no way this is the, it must happen there is no way for this to happen without equal to unit which is basically this if string are equal they need to be equal and then so it need to, to equal to underscore unit and we know this need to have do you even and we can add that unit so the password of course it's do you even unit and that's the and that is the basically the the room so the password of course is do you in it uh, that's the only way so this room tools even you can you can say solve it from L trace because L trace would give you the idea that there is an empty here so it give you the format is correct and it give you here how how the data is collected okay guys hope you like it and thank you very much have a good day